All right, guys, welcome back to another reaction video. My name is James. I'm Nobu. And today we are going to be watching uh, Casino Royale. So, James Bond. Uh, have you heard of the character James Bond, at, at least? Okay, so yes. you've heard of James Bond. Super famous character, big pop. I think it was books first, actually. I think Casino Royale is the first book ever written. So he's oh, a literary okay. character first. Uh, there's been a bunch of different versions of Bond. I don't know all of them, so like school us in the Bond lore that I don't know in the comments. This was the most recent Bond. Um, Daniel Craig, who also played uh, Benoit Blanc in Knives Out. That's the only thing I think you've ever seen him in. Um so he was the it's detective in Knives Out. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, I don't think you've ever seen him in anything. Uh, this is the only Bond movie ever that I've seen. I haven't seen any of the rest of the Craig Bonds or anything else. We're going to be doing a big a big Bond marathon. At the very least, we're going to do all the Daniel Craig movies. And then if you guys like them and you guys want us to watch more of them, let us know. I, like I said, it could be really cool. I've only ever seen one Bond movie ever. You don't know really anything about no Bond. Okay, so you'll get a vibe for it. Um, so yeah, I don't know. Uh, let us know if you guys want us to do some more of that in the comments. As always, Full Length Rash is going to be up with the Patreon. The next week's um, reaction, uh, Quantum of Solace, is going to be up for early access if you guys want to go ahead and check that out. And yeah, let's just get into Casino Royale. All right, so so do you know anything about this character? Like, what do you know? Um, like Spy or something? Okay, so like basically That's nothing. <clears throat> wait, he's a spy, right? I, I, yes, he is. Okay, <laughs> I was like, he's wait, a princess. Did I get that wrong? <laughs> it's totally something. He's actually an accountant. Nah, I mean honestly, I'm pretending like I know, and I don't either. I don't really know much, much more. Oh yeah, I love the black and white opening. This came out in 2006, so this is purely stylistic. He already has a very different vibe. Ooh, I like that. <laughs> uh, someone sitting there. <laughs> M really doesn't mind you earning a little money on the side, Dryden. She just prefer it if it wasn't selling oh, secrets. Oh yeah, I remember this guy. The theatrics are supposed to scare me. You have the wrong man, Bond. I love this, this, like, If M was so sure I was bent, she'd have sent a double O. Your file shows no kills, and it takes two. <laughs> Shame. We barely got to know each other. Oh, you're so screwed, buddy. I know where you keep your gun. Bro, you didn't tell the, <laughs> didn't tell the weight? Come on. How did you die? Your contact? Not well. <laughs> I like how they're both black and white, but different film styles. Yeah. Yeah, that's not well is one way to put it. <laughs> Jeez, man, that was just brutal. Did you feel it, did you? Wow. You didn't worry. The second is... <laughs> yes. Considerably. <laughs> Have you ever seen that before? Yeah, I feel like I that's recognize Bond. that. That's always in all the Bond movies. Oh, like. Okay. The other thing about Bond is that the songs are very important. So like every Bond movie has a song. Um, and they literally even give them a set uh, to mind. I've been told at least they give them even a set of like keys that you have to use in all of them. So like a Bond song is very important. Interesting. And obviously this opening is just so stylistic yeah <laughs> that's sick if you have to do opening credits this is the way to do it man yeah, and really all the card symbols is that animation like 3d i guess so. uh, it like looks really, like it uh like tracking i love this song <laughs> that's interesting i don't think i ever watched this opening this is really cool <laughs> With like 007, yeah. Oh, 007. Yeah, that's so that's James Bond's Bond. 007, yeah. That was really cool. That was super cool. I was and trying on, to listen to the song. And on a total side note, I, I know that now they're talking about uh Henry Cavill being the next Bond, so Ooh. Joe's throwing that out there for our boy. Yo. <laughs> How do I trust this man that I've never met with my money? You ask for the introduction. Yeah, these guys are feeling good, right? <laughs> yeah, the, uh, definitely the upstanding citizens. Oh my gosh, he even has the... Uh, <laughs> He's the like scar. the... Yeah, seriously put the Bond lore in the comments. Because I know, like, uh, peripherally, like, okay, the villains are a big deal. Like, there's a lot of, like, iconic Bond villains and different... And I don't know anything about that. So, you know, school us. Do you believe in God, Mr. Le Chief? No. The Chief. I believe in a reasonable rate of return. Hmm. I want no risk in the portfolio. Agreed. I have the money, so short another million shares of Skyfleet stock. Wow. 
No one expects this stock to go anywhere but up. Just do it. So he's totally he's totally doing something with the market then. Yeah, because he knows. That yeah, means he knows information that you know other people obviously don't have. <laughs> Ooh, Mighty Esper. I I do like how coming from Mission Impossible, <laughs> this feels like like Mission Impossible for adults or something. And I know it's just they're both in the spy genre, but it's just funny. Well, it feels like a a darker kind of version. Yeah, yeah, because like I said, it's the same genre. Looks like our man. Burn scars on his face. Ooh. Dang, look at those scars. Ellipsis. Ellipsis. He's on the move. Stop touching your ear. Yeah, yeah dude. You- Put your hand down. Yeah, bro, you look so... What the... Idiot. He he stood out a lot. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. This guy, Whoa. how did you even get in this organization, bro? Yeah, what the Dang. The parkour. I think this was parkour was like starting to pick up and movies were like, oh, this is cool. Yeah. Like actual free running. I think this guy's a free running like expert. Oh dang. Ooh. Hey okay. man, do what you gotta do. <laughs> oh god. Let's go, baby. Come on, think smarter, not harder. Oh my Dang. god. <laughs> Bro, this guy doesn't stand a chance. Dang. Or not. I mean he's what freaking spider manning it up the building. Dang. While it's still moving. Oh. Jeez. These poor random workers, bro. Uh. Oh my gosh. Where are you gonna go? I don't know. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this guy's this insane. <laughs> He's like, bro, what are you doing this to me for? I feel like you shouldn't even follow him at this point, because like if he goes on the crane, he can only come down a few ways. I mean, what do we need? <laughs> Watch out. <laughs> Smart. Yeah, you're so screwed, buddy. Jeez, man. Ah, uh, I would die. Jeez. Whoa. Look at this shot, man. Okay. <laughs> Dang. This guy. Yeah, I was gonna say, do you have the same type of- I like that he does it. Yeah, free run skills? Like, probably not. You're gonna oh. really. Ow. I do like that he doesn't. He's not as good at, yeah, as him at free running. Skills, yeah. Oh, okay. gosh. Oh. I feel like this guy's doing a lot of the stunts, too. I mean, in little pieces and stuff, yeah, yeah. but. No, yeah. I'm sure they got like a free running person. But it's like, sick. Right? Dang. Ah. <laughs> He's like, damn. He's like, come on, man. Stop this is not high even fair. Level stuff. Hmm. Do you know how tired you'd be after all this? Oh my gosh. Like, it better be worth it, man. This guy better have, like, nuclear codes or something. Wait, what the heck? Shoot. He's in the He's embassy. In the embassy. Ooh. Yeah, bro. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, bro, I don't think you can go into the embassy. Whoa. Oh. Dude, he's going all out. <laughs> this is ow. Did <laughs> the embassy Dang. soldiers don't care about any like I don't know. Oh. Hmm. What did this guy do? I don't know. And how is he related? Is he like a relative? Listen, Tombe. Oh. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> He's just the best. I'm so confused though. What this guy had something in his bag, it looks like. Oh, okay. Jeez. 
it's I, I'm trying to figure out like so is he what's his like because like I feel like that would cause issues right? I, you know what yeah I'm no no I, I mean I think it might I think he's I think he's MI6 right so he's whatever they're so like British like, yeah, yeah 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 British intelligence weeping blood comes merely from a derangement of the tear duct nothing sinister <laughs> bro you can't tell me nothing sinister when you're like that I'm sorry I'm even more scared. I have two pan, you have a 17.4% chance of making you straight. I'm so worried because I, I really don't know anything. I don't know enough about poker. <laughs> Give our guests five minutes to leave or we'll throw them overboard. <laughs> How the hell could Vaughn be so stupid? Yeah, so. Okay. In the old days, if an agent did something that embarrassing, he'd have the good sense to defect. <clears throat> Christ, I miss the Cold War. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I wonder if he has, because that, that was so bold, right? Like, like there's got to be a, or hopefully a good reason. Yeah, because I, I didn't, it didn't, I don't know, like, register with me that, like, Bond would be, like, the reckless type. No, I mean, even seeing the way that he, like, f chased him and fought shows you that he's a lot, like, smarter and calculated. Yeah. Who is this? Who, oh. That's what he just snuck in. <laughs> we wanted to question him, not to kill him. I thought the one less bomb maker in the world would be a good thing. Exactly. One bomb maker. Yeah. And thanks to your overdeveloped trigger finger, we have no idea who hired him or why. Well. And how the hell did you find out where I lived? <laughs> Same way I found out your name. I thought M was a randomly assigned letter. I had no idea it stood for... Utter one more syllable and I'll have you killed. <laughs> Go and stick your head in the sand somewhere and think about your future. Because these bastards want your head. Yeah, I, I like that there's like repercussions for stuff. Yeah. And Bond, don't ever break into my house again. Mom. Such an interesting interaction. I don't even know what to think of that. Well, it seems like she wants to believe in him, but she can't really. But what was he doing on her computer? Well, he was probably looking for where the call came from or something. Maybe. I'm just curious why he was doing that there. Good day, sir, and welcome to the Ocean Club. <laughs> this man just has the greatest style. Look at it. Like, I don't, on vacation or supposed vacation, bro, I'm in like a t-shirt and flip-flops. <laughs> Hello? Are you going to take this or make me wait? Certainly, sir. Sorry, sir. <laughs> Dangerous to just randomly assume <laughs> someone just sitting there is like. I mean, well done. <laughs> <laughs> what a legend. I really like how they're not really explaining exactly what we're after yet. I think that's really cool. Yeah. It's just, it's just like a mature movie, you know what I mean? It treats you seriously. Who was here on hmm. the date? Mm. Ooh. Yeah, who is that guy? Hey, the only way he picked up on him was because um, of the phone, right? Yeah. Checking in? Yes, but it's a spur of the moment thing and I have a little reservation. We have an Ocean View Villa. <laughs> Perfect. How? Bro, they never have the regular ribs. And I parked my car next to a very beautiful 1964 Aston Martin. <sighs> and I'm ashamed to say I nicked the door. You wouldn't happen to know. Mr. Demetrius, if he hasn't noticed, I'm not sure I'd mention it. <laughs> but if I felt compelled to find him. He has a house just up the beach. Thank you. Nice. <laughs> so smooth. You're freaking... This is, just, this is like amazing. Like the, the like scenery. It's like, oh, like riding a horse on the <laughs> beach. It's like, oh my gosh, man. This is just incredible. Bond just swimming, casually picking up girls. <laughs> <laughs> like, just looking. Uh-oh. What? He's in the Bahamas. <laughs> you woke me to share his holiday plans. Well, he's logged into our secure website using your name and password. Well, how the hell does he know these things? <laughs> Who's he looking at? Alex Demetrios. That slimy bugger. Hmm. <laughs> I feel like he knows they gotta be looking. Maybe not. A sheaf. So clearly something came to mind when that guy popped up, the sheaf. Yeah. We've had a good night. And, and I wonder if this is about what she was talking about, where like like someone's like funding uh, terrorist organizations. Possibly. And and his information was like an accountant or something too, like a banker or an accountant. That's what makes him a little more suspicious. Do you mind if I join you? Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. 
Bond operates in an interesting way. I'm worried he's going to just start blasting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's hard to tell. I'm in. Because sometimes he's super... I mean, I feel like even his blasting is calculated, though. That's to you. Sorry, bro. Was for lunch, you're two hours late. You should give up, man. She's already in love with Bond. All in. Oh, dang. No way. 20,000. Here's some more. Oh, dang. Table stakes. I'm sorry, sir. This is on the table. That's my car. Want a bet? <laughs> I'm sorry, Mr. Demetrius. Please, no. Give him a chance to win his money back. <laughs> oh, bro. He's going to take your money, your car, and your girl. Three kings. <laughs> Trip aces. Aces win. I wonder, did he like... Oh, and the money too. <laughs> Thank you. I feel like the dealer was kind of like, yeah. <laughs> Thank you, sir. <laughs> my mistake. Can I give you a lift home? That would really send him over the edge. What about a drink in my place? Is it close? Very. One drink. Yeah, I feel like she's not that close. She's not that like invested in. Yeah. yeah. No, 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 no. Not at all. And was the card the play? No, this. I mean that's it's worth it regardless. That's true, but I just the Aston Martin. I mean, <laughs> we're here, <laughs> bro. The man's got charm. I'll give him that. This is where the that dude is, right? The, the chief. I'm having or a hard time seeing how this is my fault. Maybe it's I don't know. Yeah. Oh yeah, it is. It is. You like married women, don't you, James? I keep them simple. <laughs> Does he that's... want something from her though, or is he just like? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like clean in house. In the beginning, I would have said that like he had some sort of plan, but why I, can't Les guys be more like you? I feel like, he, according to his personality, like he is a little bit like um, he's got a little bit of like that attitude. You he know? does. He has like a reckless side to him. I'm afraid you were sleeping with me in order to get to him. She's not stupid. I'm afraid. Uh, not enough to stop. Yeah, I was gonna say. It seem like <laughs> enough. Does ellipsis mean anything to you? Should I ask him about it? <laughs> He's on the last flight to Miami, so you have all night to question me. Can I get a bottle of chilled Bollinger Gordon and the Beluga Caviar? The band is just cultured. <laughs> no, for one. He dipping. <laughs> He's gotta get the mission done. I love the music, all the brass, all the, it's so awesome. It's very um heroic feeling. Yeah, movie. it does have that feel to it. It has like a rising sort of like feel. Wait here. This is all. What is this? Better be careful, bro. Like has like uh, he's gonna recognize you. Yeah, and it'll be really suspicious if you're there. Yeah. What was that? I put a little little like key thing. Yeah. Part of the plan? I don't know. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, what is with this ellipsis? Yeah, but like, what or is ellipses? it, right? That's the real question. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Go to the bags. No! Someone was too fast. That was super fast. Call, yeah. <gasps> That's risky, dude. <laughs> right, but how did you get a taxi that you know, <laughs> to follow that guy? Like, okay. I love the filmmaking. They do a really good job. Uh, they're doing really yeah. cool camera work and and showing him following and stuff. They're doing it really well. Be careful, bro. Don't be too obvious. He's looking in a mirror. She like. Mm. Oh no, <laughs> dude. This guy's smart. I feel like he's not gonna. Oh, oh he's got him. He got him. He's got okay. him. Ah. Uh -huh. Oh. Tell him to call security at Miami Airport because I think the bomb is about to go off. Bond? What the hell are you up to? I'll call you back. Ooh. Oh, does he have oh. like. Oh. That yeah, clue to start the code? That was really risky, though, because, like... Jeez. Yeah, Skyfleet S-570 prototype. Oh, great. Great, bro. Oh, no. Hmm. 
Dude, can you imagine? Shoot, he's gonna change. Oh, oh never mind. Shoot. No, he's just gonna get, grab his gun. That's so smart, though. Just create chaos and then. His target is the Skyfleet Predator. It's launching today. Oh, she's oh, gonna no. take a car, a police Shoot. car. Oh, no, no, bro. <laughs> Wait, there's no way that they're gonna launch this plane with all that chaos. Oh, Come my on. gosh. Look at this. This is insane. Did anybody know how they filmed some of this? Like, I don't know how much of it was practical or not. Let us know. Oh. Jeez. It's the poor dude doing his job. <laughs> dead. I know. It's like all these minimum wage workers that get killed in these movies. I know, bro. <laughs> His running skills are putting Tom Cruise to shame. Uh, I doubt that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, day. You better hurry up, bro. Come on, man. This is easy mode. There's handles on the top of the car. Come on. Shoot. Is he going to be like a suicide bomber, though? I feel like it, he might, right? He might just... Oh, gosh, bro. Can you make him... Hurry up. Get on. <laughs> ah. Oh. It stopped him a little bit. It did, it did. Jeez, the plane in the background. I don't know if you're gonna catch. Oh, watch out. Shoot, man. Oh my gosh, that is. Come on, come on, come on. Ha, you made it easier for us. <laughs> don't blow up the car beforehand. Whoa. Shoot. Oh, that was sick. Yeah, thank you. Oh. No, oh, nice, nice. Okay. Don't, guys. Oh, no. Jeez, man. Do you not? <laughs> Dang. Would that happen? Yeah, I feel like it would. Oh. Oh, shoot. Oh. Oh, of course, dude. Are you serious? Yeah, 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 yeah. Turn it, turn it, turn it. We better watch out, dude. They might, they're going to think you did it. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, but he's... Where is it? Did he put it on him? <laughs> well played. I'm sorry, I'm not sure yet how much you've lost. One hundred and one million two hundred and six thousand dollars. Oh, was he betting on the stock of the plane? I think he might have been. Talked? I think so. Like, or or somehow related to that. Yeah, like it, or yeah, he's like manipulating the stocks by like you know forcefully doing things. <laughs> Yeah, can our boy get some credit for like just a wonderfully played move there? Jeez. She was tortured first. Do you know anything that could compromise you? No. Not your name? What you were after? No. Well, Didn't she know his name? She said James. Ow. <laughs> so you can keep an eye on me? Yes. <laughs> They're like, enough. We're tracking you. After 9-11, the CIA discovered a massive shorting of airline stocks. When the stocks hit bottom on 9-12, somebody made a fortune. Uh-oh. Mm. The same thing happened this morning with Skyfleet stock, or was supposed to. You think it's this man, the chief? Which would explain how he could set up a high-stakes poker game at Casino Royale in Montenegro. Hmm. Winner takes all, potentially 150 million. Jeez. We can't let him win this game. We'll give him sanctuary in return for everything he knows. I'm putting you in the game. Replacing someone who's playing for a syndicate. Gotta play some poker. Oh, yeah. I would ask you if you could remain emotionally detached, but I don't think that's your problem, is it, Bond? Hmm. No. You knew I wouldn't let us drop, didn't you? Well, I knew you were you. He's such an interesting character, and I do like seeing yeah. that kind of cold, careless, uh, like spy kind of, you know, and them not be afraid to show that. Where it's like, no, he doesn't. Doesn't matter if this this random lady dies. You know what I mean? Well, yeah. Like, I mean, it's about the mission, the and that's done, it. Yeah. I'm the money. <laughs> Every penny of it. <laughs> the treasury has agreed to stake you in the game. Best, but I do hope you gave your parents hell for that. This is the <laughs> lady that was 
on the face of the queen card, right? Oh, in the opening? Yeah. I think so. I don't remember what card it was. You don't think this is a very good plan, do you? So there is a plan. I got the impression we were risking millions of dollars and hundreds of lives on a game of luck. Yeah. <laughs> well, that is the plan. <laughs> you see, by the way you ignored the quip about your parents, I'm going to have to get with Orphan. Hmm. Since you first thought about me, ran to Orphan, that's what I'd say you are. <laughs> Wouldn't go as far as calling you a cold-hearted bastard. Yeah, of course not. Eh, somewhere in between. I will be keeping my eye on our government's money and off your perfectly formed hearts. You noticed. <laughs> Even accountants have imagination. <laughs> <laughs> the writing, bro. Good evening, Mr. Bond. Good evening, Miss Lind. <laughs> I like that exchange. I do too. It shows a lot about her character. And his and it character. It shows even more about his character. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Thank you. I, I, I honestly have to just say I'm a sucker for the spy genre too. Like it's so like, all right, we got all the freaking crazy suits and the yeah. car. Like it's just cool. And just the vibe of like secretly doing yeah. this badass. I'm Mr. Arlington Beach, professional gambler, and you're Miss Stephanie Broadchester here. I am not. You're going to have to trust me on this. <laughs> oh, no, I don't. <laughs> am I going to have a problem with you, Bond? No, you're not my type. <laughs> Smart. Oof. Single. <laughs> Oof. We'll work together fairly well. I'm I assuming. think so. Your name, sir? James Bond. You'll find the reservation under Beach. Hmm. He knows who I am and where the money's coming from, which means he's decided to play me anyway. Ooh. That tells me something about him. And now he knows something about you. He knows you. Yeah, I feel like he's he's being kind of yeah. cocky. <laughs> yeah, like because the next like one. he's there assuming isn't that. For me and your ego. Ooh. Just he's assuming you. that there's no one else as good as him, you know. Yeah, he he look, he's really smart, but he is cocky and like 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 a little bit, I guess, a little bit reckless. No, he's definitely reckless. But I like that he's not stupid either. You know what I mean? Because I feel like the reckless trope is. Ooh. I love you too, man. <laughs> Dang. Look at this place. My name is Mathis. I'm your contact here. Does he know we've been watching him? The chief? I don't think so. He does now. Uh... The chief of police and he are now quite close. I thought about trying to buy services, but we frankly couldn't afford to out to be to the chief. Oh, oh gosh. The accountants seem to be running MI6 these days. Oh, not that I have anything <laughs> against accountants. <laughs> I decided that it was cheaper to supply his deputy with evidence that we were bribing the chief. Mm. It's amazing what you can do with Photoshop these days. <laughs> I think your odds are improving, Mr. Bond. Well played. Okay. I still think this might not go as smooth as we think it will be. No, I, I mean, look, it's a it got a long movie. I need you looking fabulous. I have a dinner jacket. Uh -huh. There are dinner jackets and dinner jackets. This is the latter. <laughs> and I need you looking like a man who belongs at that table. How? The, it's tailored. I sized you up the moment we met. <laughs> <laughs> well played. And I mean, dude, come on. She did well. It's like, dang, why do I look so good? <laughs> <laughs> dang. Look at that, man. Welcome, Mr. Beach. Or is that Bond? Uh, I'm a little confused. Oh, well, we wouldn't want that, would we? <laughs> so what's his play? I don't know. I feel like it's it's all about the mind games. Mr. Bond, we proceed alphabetically. Please be so kind as <laughs> to enter the password of your choice. All right, so this. All right, come on. Don't be doing like zeros or something. Ellipse? Did he enter? Ellipse? He said six letters, right? Didn't he? Or I don't know if he said it has to be six letters or yeah. at least six letters. Enjoy the game. Can you imagine working this gig? That's what I'm thinking about. Like being the dealer or like the bartender. Check. Hmm. Uh, this is what hey, you gotta figure 50, out. 000. You gotta figure out the tells, yeah? Does this seem too... Oh, this doesn't seem too forced. Good luck, darling. <laughs> it's up to you, Monsieur Bond. Monsieur Bond? Oh, I'm sorry, what was the bet? 100,000? <laughs> Bro, he's totally doing that on purpose. I just wonder if it's too much, you know? I don't know, be man. Bet 200,000. Be careful, man. A full house to Monsieur Le Chiffre. Mr. Bond? Fold. Yeah, he might be playing. He might be playing a little reckless. Dry martini. Oui, monsieur. Shake it over rice and then add a thin slice of lemon peel. <laughs> I'll have one of those. So lie. <laughs> Anyone want to play Pokemon? <laughs> Would you excuse me? He's he's kind of taking time. Yeah, and he's pissing him off. Well, Monsieur, I thought we dispense with covers. No, 
This is me in character, pissed off because you're losing so fast. <laughs> <laughs> it was worth it to discover his talent, the twitch he has to hide when he bluffs. Mm. When he did his first raise, he had nothing. When he was blind, it's look. Ooh. You get the bug? Yes. Okay, 100,000. Thank you. Huh. Maybe he can actually pull this off. I love how how it's not like some crazy action thing. It's like, it's such high stakes, it, no pun intended, but like, it's all high class, kind of like, oh, we're just yeah. playing poker. And, but it's not like some crazy drop through the air shoot. It's time for a short break. We will resume play in one hour. It shows the strength and the subtleties, you know, that yeah. Spy needs to have. No, yeah. To figure things and the out. long game. Ooh. Salute. You better hope nobody caught that. Yeah. Is she supposed to be there? I don't know. So what? What's so damn important? I'm so. Oh, jeez. What yeah. is that? My money. Oh. Oh, this is oh, the. Because he's using people's money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're holding a parcel for me. Thank you. Ah. Jeez, jeez man. That kind of money and no one would notice. Open that. Huh. He knows. Jeez. A freaking machete. I will take a hand for this betrayal, but you need it to bleed out. Uh oh. This poor girl, man. Hold out your arm, my beauty, or I will take your head. No! Oh, jeez. Stairs. No! Uh. Go, 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 go. Oh, no. Yeah, he saw, dude. Oh, my gosh. Oh, good play. How are we gonna hide this though? Dang. Oh, shoot. Ugh. You have to get that freaking weapon away. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, he's gotta save the girl too. Shoot, man. Oh, there we nice. go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Get it, Vesper, get it, get it, get the freaking machete. Oh, he's got him. Oh, what? Oh, shoot, of course. Shoot it. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Nice. Oh, whoa, careful. Go find Matthews. Tell him I've hidden the bodies down here, and I want him to get rid of them. You hid the bodies down here. <laughs> That's a good way of putting it. I wonder if Lashif, like, heard any of that, you know? I don't know. But he's got, we gotta go back to poker and what? Yeah. 30 minutes now? I mean, there's no way, like, he's not gonna notice, you uh, know? Hopefully that will dull the pain. So hopefully. You just gotta, you gotta calm down, right? And play it cool. You changed your shirt, yeah. Mr. Tom. I hope our little game isn't causing you to perspire. But I won't consider myself to be in trouble until I start weeping blood. Hmm. What? <laughs> okay, I was a little worried there. Nah, I mean, she just, she's a civilian, right? I mean, I'm glad that they're showing, like, it's not even a weakness. It's just like it's like this blood on my hands. Vulnerability. Yeah, because you're not used to a certain thing. Yeah, right? which is super understandable. And she's. I mean, he was freaked out. Yeah, it's understandable. I like too that she's like a strong female character without like, but she's allowed to be vulnerable. You know, I mean, even Bond is, and I well, like that a lot. Yeah, but also it's like, how should I say? You can be that like that sort of person that's like not. Um, competent in physical strength, right? And that's, I feel like we put too much importance on um, physical ability. I agree. You know what I'm saying? Or being used to fighting and things like that. And that, yeah, being able to handle tragedy and things like that. It's like, that's just an area that some people are strong. Yeah, she's probably never killed anybody before. Yeah. You have any trouble with the bodies? Let's do some. How's our girl? Melted your cold heart yet? <laughs> be careful. Like, like we're doing well, but let's not be stupid either. Ooh. <laughs> Bet five hundred thousand. Oh dang, those are. That's a lot. That's a lot. Oh, he's bluffing, bro. It's the tell. My God, the James was right. Yeah, but some. What if you know your own tell, right? Because then you can set yeah, them up. Yeah. Race, one million. Seems someone knows something I don't. Four. <laughs> Remember, you gotta watch out because he's always looking at you, right? Yeah, so it's yeah, like yeah. Bond himself could have a tell, right? Two. Oh my gosh. It doesn't really matter right now, but. I'm on it. What? Jeez. 
What? That's insane. That that's well, either it's like fourteen million, five hundred thousand. It's I up mean, to you, Mr. Bond. Wait, I mean, dude. I mean, what do you? That's a I such a. I have to go all in to call this bluff. But that's such yeah, a. Yeah, but that's so risky. Gentlemen, show down, please. Is he that gonna go that hard Full on a house. bluff? Kings on aces. Oh wow. Okay. Okay. Uh oh. <sighs> oh no, dude. Wins. Dude, you got played. That's not good. Yeah. We will now break for one hour. Yeah, he. It's exactly what you said. He he tricked him into thinking he was, or or he knows his tell and he used it against him. Yeah, because like if you have an obvious tell, it's like. But now what? Now what are we? We don't have money. Do? We went We're all in. like screwed. Unless the 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 government can just. <laughs> You know, it's like, another 10 million. But are, would they even be willing at this point? It's like, bro, you lost all of that money on one play. And a stupid play. You yeah, know, like if anybody else looks at that, in. that was dumb. I'm going to need the other 5 million to buy that game. I can't do that, James. I'm sorry. Sorry? Yeah, she's got it. You lost because of your ego. And that same ego can't take it. That's what this is about. Yeah, yeah it is. You're a bloody idiot. Look in my eyes. I can beat this man. You know that. Yes, but you're also super. Can you cocky. though? Yeah. Because you you thought that in the first place, right? So, is there anything that you figured out that makes you think that you can beat him now, or is it just your ego talking? Right, that's the basic question. Although I don't see another alternative because it's kind of like we just gave that man. <laughs> Yeah, but but right, she she's got a job to do, and her job is to make sure that he doesn't recklessly spend it. Yeah, like I give it down. <laughs> so that's the other thing is that Bond's drink is a is a vodka martini, uh, shaken, not stirred. So okay, interesting. I don't know what any of that means. Oh my gosh, what? bro! James, get the girl out. Oh bro, we, my you, gosh, this is so. I mean, I like the direction this is headed. I should introduce myself. Felix Slater, a brother from Langley. Oh, uh, central intelligence. I'm bleeding chips. I'm not gonna last much longer. You have a better chance, I'll stake you. Oh. Just one thing, if you pull it off, the CIA bring him in. Hmm. So then in exchange- And what about the winnings? Does it look like we need the money? <laughs> <laughs> He's like, central okay, intelligence Okay, okay, don't gonna fine. flex over here, America. <laughs> Bet, raise. Be careful, dude. And fold. Uh oh. What is it? What was that? Oh. That was her. That was her. That's her, his the girlfriend or whatever. Oh no. Right. Is that gonna be our drink? I don't we <sighs> It might be, right? Fold. It's like who else? Well, I don't know. It was in one of the one of the martinis. Fold. Yeah, so it, who else is getting it? But I feel like the fold. chances you know what I'm saying, it doesn't matter. It was probably oh, for us. Oh no, bro. Come oh, yeah. on, dude. Deal, man. Sorry, sir. You are the big blind. It looks bad, though. Whoa, I love this. It's cool. The overexposed. Yeah, 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 yeah. And the, the frame rate is all off. Hopefully he got it out in time, though. Oh, my like, gosh, dude. Does he have any sort of, like, yeah, secret? Yeah, there was a thing in here. There was a thing in here. I feel like he should have told somebody. That's what he's doing. Yeah, but I mean, like, uh, what's her name? You know, just in case. Bond's being poisoned. He's going into cardiac arrest. You'll be dead within two minutes unless you do exactly what. Right, hurry I'm up! I'm all ears. Yeah, jeez. Remove the defibrillator from the pouch. Attach the leads to your chest. He's gonna have to defibrillate himself. Push the red button now, Bond. What? Why is it not working? It's not. Bond, push the damn button. Do it now. It's not charged. Oh no. It unplugged. Oh. Dude. Come on. Come on, Vesper. Oh, come on. Come, 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 on. On. come on, bro. Just plug it back in and press the thingy. Good thing she was on it. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. I'll get you stuff off to hospital. I don't know if he can do that. As soon as I've won this game. <laughs> We're not seriously going back there. I wouldn't dream of it. All in. Call. All in. Jeez. This he's, guy. He's this taking guy. care of business. Two pair. Aces and sevens. Queen plays. Wins. Okay, but the CIA, yeah, they, they might be, you know, funded well, but they got to step up their uh, poker game. Like, <laughs> I'm sorry. Get some better training in. That last hand. 
Nearly killed me. <laughs> Bet it's six million. Race. Because <sighs> and he has all the money, bro. <sighs> the showdown. Forty million five hundred thousand all in. All in. Oh my, bro! After the <laughs> last time, are you kidding me? He's bluffing. Mm, that's not very good. <clears throat> Is it his little thingy? I think I will call you on that one. He's totally bluffing. Flush, ace, king, queen, full house, eight Jeez. full of aces. I mean, I guess as long as he doesn't have the money. A higher full house. Oh, my bad. I don't know Aces anything about poker. <laughs> Clearly, I thought that was lower. Yeah, my bad. I don't know anything about poker either. Monsieur Bond? Come on, bro. <laughs> I think we're good. <laughs> The straight flush. Oh, okay. So, Four to the eight. Yeah. The high hand. Uh oh. Let's go. Monsieur Pawn wins. For you. Thank you very much. A hmm. <laughs> hundred grand he just throws him. It's all yours. Much appreciated, brother. Be careful. <laughs> Congratulations. You know I think the celebration's in order. You were almost dead an hour ago. That's a reason to celebrate. Mathis says the Americans have made contact with Le Chiffre. Okay. It's an Algerian love knot. Someone gave them to you. He's a very lucky man. Hmm. You can switch off so easily, can't you? It doesn't bother you killing those people. Well, I wouldn't be very good at my job if it did. Yeah, he has to, right? Yeah, like, he's probably done that several he times. He can't. He can't so. be a real person. He's got to. Mathis needs me. Good night. Congratulations, Ed. Hmm. Mathis. Oh. Uh oh. Shoot, dude. So he thinks what? Math Mathis was uh, backstabbing him? Yeah, maybe. <laughs> Whoa! Yeah. You're screwed. Who are these guys? Oh, it's 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 him. It's, it's Le Chief. Well, but the. Le Chief. I thought the oh. CIA was going for him. At dawn. Oh, did they say at dawn? Oh, great. Well, why didn't we go after him now, bro? They got the stupid tracker out, too. Because now he's desperate now. He needs the money, right? I'm afraid your friend Mathis is really my friend Mathis. Hmm. Uh oh. This isn't good. Well, because once we once we do away with all the civility, it's like they have the power, bro. It's one man versus a whole Arby. Yeah, in the end, it kind of relies. It, it goes back to kind of like that brute force. It's like there's like just a poker game, but it's like they don't need that. No, they can just yeah. Do whatever. Oh, dang. Uh-oh. It's torture time. Yeah. Jeez, bro. That's brutal. Oh, man. Dang. Jeez, bro. I never understood all these elaborate tortures. It's the simplest thing to cause more pain than a man can possibly enjoy. Yeah, it's true. Oh my gosh. Will you yield in time? I want the money. Jeez. Miss Lynn will give me the account number, so all I need from you is the password. I mean... The password, please. I've got the ledge. Down there. <gasps> Would you mind? Damn. <laughs> Yiker. What a what a legend. Oh, no! To the right! To the right! <laughs> you are a funny man, Mr. Bond. Ah! Yes! What a... Yes! Yes! <laughs> legend, man. Now the whole world's gonna know that you don't scratch your fucking balls. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> I died? Yes. Because no matter what you do, I'm not going to give you the password, which means your clients are going to hunt you down and cut you into little pieces That's of true. meat while you're still yep. breathing. Because he's the one that ha that doesn't have the leverage, right? But you are so wrong! Your people would still welcome me with open arms. Because they need... That's what true, I dude! I feel like best yeah, best, best might be a bigger weakness, 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 right? Yeah. Like and I would have him. Bond. Well, you really aren't going to tell me, I... No. Ah. Oh. 
Who? I'll get the money. What's that? Is it one of the... I'll get the money. Money isn't as valuable to our organization as knowing who to trust. Oh, jeez. That was a sick shot. That was cool, yeah. Francesco. Come on. This has got to be heaven. They're speaking Italian. <laughs> It's just God killing everyone else, but leaving you and her untouched. Get a look at the killer. Yeah. No. Oh, I guess he didn't see him now. Shame. Drink really? Up. I feel like he could have. He was. He had a. He had an angle on him. Anything else you remember that can help us? Help us? Or help you? Ooh. Yeah, I mean, he betrayed them. Yeah, but now, um, what's his name's dead? The sh the sheaf or whatever. So now what? I can't resist waking you. Every time I do, you look at me as if. You haven't seen me in years. It makes me feel reborn. If you'd just been born, wouldn't you be naked? <laughs> Freaking fraud. <laughs> Does this mean that you're warming to me? Yeah. Well, you guys went through... You guys went through um, a lot together. <laughs> yeah. My apologies. It's a banker, dude, right? Rush, yeah. But 120 million is a large sum of money. Yeah, you got to decide where you want to put it. And that's the password. V. Wow. E. S. E. <laughs> e. R. I just wanted to know that if all that was left of you was your smile and your little finger, you'd still be more of a man than anyone I've ever met. <laughs> That's because you know what I can do with my little finger. You're not going to let me in there, are you? You've got your armor back on. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I have no but armor left. But he's definitely... You stripped it from me. I feel like he's definitely being genuine, though, like, yeah. you know? Whatever is left of me, whatever I am, I'm yours. Yeah, I mean, I think I think you're right. I think I think he is being genuine. It is. It's hard to say at times, though. Like, you know, because for example, like he's still willing to do the mission, right? Sure. And he would. I think he would sacrifice her. I mean, he was willing to there, right? <laughs> okay. okay. Don't get back hurt. in the hospital bed. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just worried. Well, then won't miss me for a couple of days. She'll be too busy sweating like this. Hmm. Remember, I told you about the she's tell. Well, math is totally sheep. Oh. Does everyone have a tell? Everyone except you. <laughs> I wonder if that's why I love you. You love me? <laughs> enough to quit and float around the world with you until one of us has to find an honest job. Is that enough for you? Wow. <laughs> that's crazy. How much time left do we have in the movie? Is it going to be like just I mean, their daily life like from now on? You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, I mean. That's why I'm worried because like it seems so happy right now. Like, but we always know, you know, when whoever it is, secret agents, superheroes, like if you're trying to settle down, stuff, something's going to go down. Dang. I mean, seeming pretty legit right now. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Not even a two weeks notice. <laughs> yeah, like, she's like, uh, this is very unprofessional. Like, I'm out <laughs> now. <laughs> I mean, dude, this is just. What? Mm. What does that mean? Mm. It didn't look like she recognized him. It looked a little like weird. Yeah. Like almost like just slightly concerned or something. Yeah. You stopped wearing the necklace. Hmm. Yeah. It was time. Time enough to get over someone. Maybe. There's more to this. This is... Huh. Right now, I have a lovely man from the treasury here. Wondering if you're ever going to deposit the winnings. Wait, what? It appears the funds are being withdrawn as we speak. Oh my gosh. Wait, did she just d backstab us? Where? The Venice branch, of course. St. Mark's Square. I think she just did. <laughs> Where is she? Where is she? Somewhere on the water. Yeah, I mean, uh, she's in a red dress, right? Yeah, because I feel like she'd be very easy to spot unless she knew oh, that. Oh, there she is. Oh, was that oh, her? Oh. Somebody in red. Oh, what? wait, no, never mind. Wait, that, I think it might be. I don't know. It? I can't tell. I can't tell. I thought the dress looked different. I did too. Oh, no, it is. Oh, no, it is her. I would have lost her. <laughs> oh, yeah, sure. Not so much attention I paid to what she. I wouldn't have spotted her even once. Like, I wouldn't even remember what she was. <laughs> what color the dress was, frankly. <laughs> hmm. Why though? Just for the money? I feel like it was too. Yeah, there's got to be more to this. Oh, oh, oh! Nice play. Oh, he saw you. Shoot! Hello, me. Yeah, I feel like he wants revenge. Wait, who? What do you mean? Bond. Oh, you on her? Oh, that was dangerous. <laughs> Oh, dig. 
Ooh. Uh, yeah, we're on on the canal here. Uh, uh oh, the building's gonna go down. No. Oh, jeez. Dang. Somebody tell us how they did some of the stuff in this movie. It's crazy. Oh, there they are. Reflections. Ooh. Oh, dang, this guy, man. Sure. Some Venetian is going to find that on their doorstep, bro. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's going to be their lucky day. Or maybe unlucky. Oh, nice. Oh, the whole thing's coming down. Oh. Dang. What the? Oh, I thought that was a gun for a second. It's like a freaking... It's a nail gun. Oh! It's like a, a video game, like, level. The water's slowly coming up, and you have to keep going up. Oh. Oh, that was Got sick. Him. Okay, but now we gotta get out of here. Hmm. Sorry, James. Shoot. All the water out. Uh, I don't know. Uh, it was possible. It's definitely possible. Okay, well. <laughs> oh my gosh, man. I mean, did she? So she just delivered. She killed herself, essentially, right? Is that what it was? I think so. Right? Like she just. I think so. Felt like that she betrayed him. I mean, then clearly she cared for him. I mean, then she must like. Then her reason for betraying him is what, you know? They must have had something over her, kind of, or something, right? Yeah. She had a boyfriend, a French Algerian. He was kidnapped by the organization behind mm. Lichy. Okay, I see, so... And they blackmailed her, threatening to kill him unless she cooperated. She left her cell phone. She must have known I'd check it. She knew you were you. She knew. Yeah. Well, at least this clears Mathis. No. We just proved that she's guilty, not that he's innocent. You don't trust anyone, do you, James? Well, probably not anymore. Not after that. If you do need time. Why should I need more time? Job's done. The bitch is dead. Jeez. Did you ever ask yourself why you weren't killed that night? Isn't it obvious? <laughs> she made a deal to spare your life in exchange for the money. And now we'll never know who's behind this. The trail's gone cold. Yeah, she did love him. Yeah, she she did make that attempt in order to save him. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Well, that hasn't really gone cold, has it? I don't know. Let's blow up the entire thing. <laughs> Kill them all. Get rid of them. I mean, whoa, these locations. Like, what is it? <laughs> don't blow it up, yeah, actually. Like, actually, just like, hold use up. it. <laughs> well, he, that's him, Mr. White. That's the dude that was uh, with the case. Hello? Mr. White, <laughs> we need to talk. Who is this? Ooh. <laughs> Oh, hello. The name's Bond. James Bond. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? That was very interesting. It's just definitely the same genre as like Mission Impossible with that like kind of like spy. Feel. Which is the reason we're saying that is because that's kind of the first spy thing we've watched. Because I know all the comments are going to be like, this came years or whatever it is. I don't know which came first, but. No, yeah, <laughs> yeah. But. We, yeah, we watched. I mean, the only spy thing that I've ever we watched, really had is watched like was Mission Impossible. Mission Impossible. And so it has that, you know, it's the same type of genre, but it has such a different, um, at least this movie. I don't know how the other movies are going to be. Cause, and I want to say that because this movie had that whole poker scene. Um, and I think the poker sequence made it feel a lot less action movie like mm. and way more um, covert like deception like it's just so well done and and i now I, I don't know like fans of the book i i've been told by some people at least that it's actually a really accurate adaptation of the first book okay well that's always a, a um but, and i don't think casino royale had ever been done by any of the other bonds before this story okay um which is really interesting and it's so good it, like the whole idea of like it's almost like an origin story in a way 
uh, but just playing with the idea of like you know this this like cold hearted womanizer spy badass mm -hmm. like finally falling in love. Yeah, I don't know. And the way they do it is so well done. Like it's not cheesy at all. It's so subtle. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Yeah, uh, I think definitely um, the strongest points of this movie I feel like are some of the characters. Like I really liked um, Vesper. Mm. I thought she was she was portrayed like very kind of like not your typical female like um, protagonist. Or is she a protagonist? I'm trying to figure out. I was going to say like lead, but is she like a lead? I think she I don't still know technically what. would be your, your, your leading lady, I guess. Okay. Uh, well, anyway, I, I feel like the fact that she was like that whole scene with her being very um, shook up about the, um, the killing the and, fight the and things like that. Like I thought that that was really well done. It's very rare to have, especially a female character like nowadays um, show that sort of like vulnerable side. Yeah, you know yeah, yeah, yeah. And like the subtleties <clears throat> of that scene, like like yeah. the fact that neither of them take their clothes off. And I know that sounds really silly, but like the fact that she's sitting in the shower with her dress on and the yeah. water's just pouring, like stuff like that to me, I'm like, that is such a touch that that like communicates everything that needs to be communicated. Yeah, yeah. And and just the 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 fact that like I don't know, like she she had like a a sort of aggressive sort of nature to her. Mm. But it's like even then in situations where she wasn't comfortable, she it wasn't like she's aggressive always. You know what no. I'm saying? It was a much more like subtle and like complex type of character. And you know it works perfectly with Bond, right? You yeah. know what I mean? Especially since they do. And I mean, like, that's why I get why this movie is so like generally it'll be like, I don't think most movies need to be over two hours. But this movie clearly does because it 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 you need the time to establish who Bond is. Yeah. And, and then to see her interact with him maybe what 40 minutes into the movie something like that um she's perfect like 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 it makes sense and i like that i like that they don't they don't bend the script and the characters to make him fall in love i like that they wrote a character that he would fall in love with yeah you know i don't know i just think yeah and then um i think the another character that i thought was done well was the villain the villain was really cool yeah and very um like while he was imposing he also wasn't like inhuman you know what i'm saying like you no i had still tell him mean. tell that he had weaknesses uh it wasn't like he was untouchable like the, the people were definitely getting to him and i kind of like that and while still looking cool and being cool you yeah. know that's that's what i want from a villain I, you know it doesn't always have to be like that but i'm just that is one no, cool way to kind of like uh, have a villain and of course bond i thought bond was really really interesting um you know he had his flaws right yeah and usually like the main character like that you're not gonna have like you'll have some flaws but it's almost like those flaws are e easy enough to kind of like overcome yeah mm -hmm. not always mm -hmm. most of the time mm -hmm. um but he does definitely he's not the how should i say like the cleanest role model you know no. what i'm saying well <laughs> Well, yeah. And so, like, <laughs> any version of Bond hasn't been. Uh, <laughs> but like, he he's still he's not a bad guy, right? No, you know no, what no, I'm no, saying? No, 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 and no, so, no. like, it's interesting to see that kind of like, well, yeah, that kind of you know, a little bit grayer type of character where it's like you know, obviously he's not like evil, but you know, he does have some flaws, and so it makes it that much more interesting, especially the whole like cold heartedness thing, right? Yeah, and and the movie like like it's a trap like if you look at the structure of it right like his character flaw right mm -hmm. or he, he is he is flaw. like he's he's and I, I like that they combine the two it's that he's super competent it's not that he's not competent it's not that he can't win but yeah. he'll still do things for the wrong reasons or stuff like that and so i feel like like him being kind of cocky and a little bit like rash and sometimes like a little bit emotional mm. um uh, is weirdly his flaw and mm -hmm. it it isn't fixed he doesn't get over it it's it it ends like a tragedy like he fails he falls for vesper and he he kind of fails in that and it kind of just it doesn't doesn't resolve it you know it's not like a it's not like a yeah. standard character arc is my point where you overcome the flaw or whatever no like, of thing course is to yeah become he the definitely full didn't overcome the flaw but then it's also weird because it's it's they do this two thing where it's like what's his flaw that he's well like human that he's caring and so you have this weird thing of like at the end of the movie, he is like probably a better spy. 
and he probably is more cold hearted and he probably won't trust anyone ever now. So you, 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 on the one hand, you're like, cool. So you did learn, but on the other hand, it's like even more tragic because it, it's like, I feel well, like he's lost his soul almost. You know yeah. what I mean? Like even he, he was telling her, it's like <laughs> he's lost his last bit of humanity. I, I guess we'll call it. I don't know. Well, I, I think that there's a few things. Like, I think that, um, while mission impossible is like, the cool like action you know like spy feel this is a lot more of like it's still cool actiony and definitely like not like realistic realistic but it's like more of that like it's, it's more serious it's trying to be more real as in like you know the stakes and no, how it's much more happen, serious right yeah it's a lot more like oh we're trying to be like this is what really happens of kind course. of feel right and so because of that it's like his i feel like his flaws you know, obviously he has a lot of flaws, but like, I feel like his biggest one is like, and I don't even know if I can really call it like a, even like a flaw, but he can't, he's cold hearted, right? Mm. He will use people and kind of discard of them, right? Um, in order to get the mission done and whether or not he's doing that for the right reason of like, you know, I'm doing it for the greater good of like, you know, saving people or not, or he's just been too long into it that he's just kind of forgotten. Mm. Um, I think that, you know, in the end, he kind of loses, you know, the game because he, you know, he, he, he now sees that like, okay, well, this is what happens when I, when I am kind of like human and caring. It's like, mm. you lose that. But I do think that towards the end, he also, even though it feels like he lost everything, like, oh, okay, now I'm just like a freaking drone and I'm going to be like a, you know, the best spy who just doesn't care and, you know, he gets the mission done. I, I still think that he definitely has emotion left in him because he's clearly, he's clearly bugged by it. Sure. You know, I mean, the fact that he called her, you know, the B word. Yeah. Shows that there's still, you know, he's frustrated. And so I feel like there already, it's like, okay, well, there's still a little bit of hope just like with the whole like shell and things like that. Right. It's almost like it was a, it was a dark ending, you know, and he will definitely be a lot more, you know, wary of things now and probably won't fall in love necessarily. Yeah. But, there's still a glimmer of like, well, he's not all gone, you mm. know, at least he was able to get frustrated and at least he, you know, for example, like getting back at white, I feel like that was, even though it was the job, it's like, I feel like that's an emotional. Oh yeah. hundred percent. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so I don't know. I feel like there's a glimmer of hope left. Yeah. Yeah. We'll see. Um, but yeah, yeah. Like I said, we're going to do, we're going to be watching all the Craig bonds and then, and let us know, let us know if you guys want to see more James Bond. I mean, I would, I actually think it would be really fun to kind of like compare the different, takes on the character and stuff like that so okay. um as always full length rashes up with the patron uh quantum of solace is going to be up for early access if you guys want to go ahead and check that out um and yeah honestly thank you for being here thank you for joining us for watching if you all are new here welcome hopefully you stick around uh we got a lot more bond coming obviously and just a lot more other movies for you guys to check out and if you do we will see you all in the next video